Just as it is the crown and not merely the will to rule that makes the king, so it is marriage and not merely your love for each other that joins you together in the sight of God. So marriage is an institution that is ordained of God. I kind of never realized about the marriage being like an institution in which the world sees us as a married couple and there are certain expectations of married couples towards society. Kakakon, Isaac, Dennis, and, and Jo, Jana. Would you please take each other by the right hand? You have taken one another by the right hand in a token of covenants which you will both now enter into in the presence of God and these witnesses. Okakakon, Isaac Damas, do you take and J.O. Janeth as your lawfully wedded wife and do you of your own free will and choice covenant with her to be her companion and lawfully wedded husband that you will cleave unto her and none else that you will observe all the laws and covenants and obligations pertaining to the holy state of matrimony that you will love her and that you'll honor her that you'll cherish her and that you will cleave unto her as long as you both shall live and J.O. Jana you have taken Okakakon Isaac de Moss by the right hand as your lawful and do you take him as your lawfully wedded husband and do you do this of your own free will and choice covenant as his companion and lawfully wedded wife that you will cleave unto him and none else that you will observe all the laws covenants and obligations pertaining to the holy state of matrimony that you also will love him and honor him and cherish him as long as you both shall live. By virtue of the legal authority vested in me as an elder in the Church of Jesus Christ of Latter-day Saints, I pronounce you Akakakon Isaac Damas and Angeo Jana, husband and wife, legally and lawfully wedded for the period of your mortal lives. May God bless this union with joy in your posterity and a long light of life of happiness together. And may he enable you to keep sacred the covenants you have made here that you will build a union of happiness and joy. These blessings I invoke upon you in the name of Jesus Christ, amen. Now, in our country it is a custom that the husband gets to kiss his wife. Wow. Do you know that that's how your marriage is going to be when you go to the temple and it becomes an eternal marriage and you're sealed for time and all eternity? There will be no beginning and there will be no end. It will be eternal. And as you put these rings on each other's hand, will you always remember that this is the beginning of an eternal marriage? Would you put hers on? left hand that finger that finger very good
good. Do you know what that means? 